In order to test your app on your Android device, you need to download MIT AI2 Companion from the Google Play Store. Just put in MIT AI2 Companion into the search and install it onto your device. Once it's installed onto your device, it should look like this. If you have an app to test, you can do it now. If you haven't, then just simply click and drag a button into the viewer, like so. We're gonna change the text on the button because by default it says text for button one. We're gonna change it to test button. And you do that in the properties under text. We are now going to change the font size, make the text bold and change the background color of the button like so. And the properties for those are here, here and here. Okay, so now we're going to get just this button that appears here to show up on our Android device. First, you need to click on connect. And then you go down to AL companion and you should get a screen like this appear with a code. Make sure you remember the code, then go over to your Android device and you're going to double click on the MIT AI2 companion. Once you've double clicked, your screen should change. You're then going to tap in the white box in order to bring up the keyboard. You enter your code and then you click on connect with code. It is possible to use your scanner that you have on your Android device in order to connect as well. All you have to do is click scan QR code and scan the code. Your Android device should now show the button that was created in App Inventor. Now let's change the background color from pink to blue. You simply go back to App Inventor. You can see in the property section, the background color. And you just simply change the color. And your button should now look like this. And it should instantly change within your Android device like so. Right, so now it's your turn. You give it a go and let me know how you get on.